pill designed to help women with desire. It's even being called the female version of Viagra. But does it work? I spoke to one woman who says the little pink pill helped spark her love life. Honey. Is perfect. We've all seen the countless ads for Viagra and medications targeting men and their sex drives. Curling up in bed with a favorite book is nice, but I think women would rather curl up with their favorite man. Wait a minute, what if a woman doesn't want to curl up with her favorite man? Probably 20% of patients will eventually come in and have, uh, will usually say, my husband wants me to talk to you about my lack of desire. <laughs> Dr. David Kallenberger with the Integris Bennett Fertility Institute says he sees women all the time who just don't want to have sex. It's a real medical issue, and he says the options to treat a woman's libido are limited. As I say, when you have intercourse, do you enjoy it? If the answer is no, the doctor suggests counseling. If the answer is yes, he recommends date night. There's only one other pharmaceutical answer right now, testosterone. And that comes with a whole list of nasty side effects. There's a new pink pill fighting its way through the FDA approval process. And it's offering women new hope. I felt like even though we were close and having a great relationship, there was something just not there. This mother of four was part of the clinical trial for the new medication, Flibanserin. I can remember the very first time driving down the road at about lunchtime in the middle of the day, thinking about my husband and all of a sudden getting a little flutter. And when I say flutter, I'm not talking about a heart rate flutter. It was a little further south, but that was the first time literally probably in my life that had ever happened to me. Amanda Parrish says the medication lit a new spark in her relationship. She started initiating sex with her husband and even bought sexy lingerie. The medication has been compared to Viagra for women, but it works differently. Doctors say this little pink pill works on a woman's brain. It's increasing those feel-good hormones in the brain. The company behind the medication says it helps busy moms de-stress and stop worrying so much about the laundry and the to-do list, leaving more room in their minds for sex. It's a cornerstone of a solid marital relationship is intimacy. Dr. Kallenberger says he would prescribe this medication to his patients as soon as the FDA approves it. So what's the holdup? The FDA says there isn't enough research behind the little pink pill, and they want to make sure it's safe. Women who've tried it, like Amanda Parrish, say they'll be the first in line once it's on the market. Now, the pharmaceutical company says they do have some new research in the works that they plan to submit to the FDA soon.